Commander. You said one of your ships had gone missing. Crashed, actually. I couldn't speak in front of the Krogan. Our ship went down on Tuchanka. Now they're pinned by an advanced guard of Reapers scouting the planet. What are your men doing there? I'm sorry. That's classified. But it's vital they be rescued. They must complete their original mission. It's a matter of... galactic peace. I'll do what I can. I appreciate your help. And understanding. That's all. Of course, Commander. This crash site's a nightmare. Edie, try to raise Lieutenant Victus. Yes, ma'am. For a Turian Commander, what happened here is... Let's just say the Turian Code is not forgiving. And that it's his son is bad for the Primarch. Promoting family without merit can bite you in the ass. What's strange is the Primarch knows that. Commander, I have to land well back from the main crash site. That the best you can do? Yes, ma'am, but the Reapers seem unaware of our presence. You might get the jump on them. All right, set her down. Let's save this platoon. Edie? Did you raise Lieutenant Victus? Yes, but the connection is bad. Patch me in. This is Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. Do you read? This is Lieutenant Tarquin Victus of the 9th Platoon. We're pinned by Reaper Harvesters and taking heavy casualties. Also, there are pockets of my men scattered along the crash trajectory. Lieutenant, I need you to fire a flare so I can find your position. Got it. Things get worse by the minute. My men are dying! This sounds bad. Let's move. I have a visual on the enemy, and there's an escape pod just beyond. Looks like the Turians are in tough. Enemies up ahead don't know we're here. Surprise on our side for once. I like it. Exactly. Let's go. Lieutenant Victus? Commander Shepard, my men and I are in your debt. Thank you for saving so many. What happened here? He screwed up. Stand down, soldier. These men are dead because of him. I said, stand down. Hey, I just saved all your asses, so everyone just calm down. Lieutenant, what's going on here? I made a bad call. This is all on me. I chose caution and clever tactics over a head-on attack. And... My men paid the price. You mean the crash? Yes. We could see on Hollow that Reaper forces were blocking our intended path. Staying on course guaranteed heavy casualties. So I chose a safer route, skirting the enemy. And that took us low and through these ruins. When we encountered resistance, there was no room to maneuver. Suddenly, we were in a fight for our lives. A lot of my men lost that fight. Making hard decisions and dealing with the consequences. That's what being a leader is about. You're right, Commander. Our mission's still a failure. When we've stabilized the injured, we'll head back to the fleet. You're abandoning your mission? We're down over 30 men. It'd be suicide. What exactly did you come here to do? There's a bomb on the planet. We were sent to defuse it. A bomb? How big? Enormous. Cerberus has it. Lieutenant, if Cerberus has that bomb, you have to finish your mission. Haven't these men sacrificed enough? Sacrifice is what we sign on for. They know that. And so should you. My men have lost hope, Commander. Even if I wanted to finish the mission, they don't. It's your job to make them want to. How? What's wrong with you? Inspire them, threaten them. Lieutenant, if Cerberus succeeds, the Reapers divide and conquer us. And then that is on them. Listen up. This isn't about your fears and grievances. Fears? We're only afraid of the next messed up order you give. Irrelevant. Court martial death and dishonor awaits anyone who walks at his duty. We are Turian. We finish what we came here to do, or we die trying. 
Shuttles arrive any minute, so get your asses in gear. Let's move! Commander, come with us. We're a shell of what we were. We could use the help. Send me the nap point. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. That'll give us time to do a little recon. See what we're up against. Victus, I've given you a second chance. Don't screw this up. Understood, Commander. Hope to see you at the rendezvous. Cerberus bomb. What the hell is going on, Commander? And what do the Turians have to do with it? Coordinates Victus gave me place it in the Kelphic Valley. It's a heavily populated area. That's all I know. My gut says something's not right here. What do you suggest? Get the Primarch to come clean. Should we alert the Krogan military? I'd wait. We're in the dark here. Krogan-Turian relations are fragile until the genophage is cured. Let's not push it. And how about this bomb? How many troops does Cerberus have on this? No idea. All I know is, we can't have them detonating that bomb. Keep me in the loop. Hack it out. Primarch Victus. Impressive work on Tuchanka. I'm grateful that... Why didn't you tell me about the Cerberus bomb? Why hide that? What else are you keeping from me? I have nothing for you. For our alliance to work, I need to trust you. Our friendship is new, Commander. Would you trust me with information that puts your people, puts Earth, at risk? If I had to choose between our alliance and lying to save my people, I'd choose Earth every time. Even if it costs you the Turian fleet? I see your point. Decisions like these weigh heavy on me. When I was a general, I could pass them up the chain of command. But now... I'm all I've got. Know what I mean? Sure. And? And... And that's all. Wait, there is one more thing, Commander. Thank you for saving my son. Normandy Shuttle, this is Lieutenant Victus with the 9th Platoon. Do you copy? We hear you, 9th Platoon. We're approaching the bomb site, Commander. Getting bounced around pretty bad. This is as close as we get, Lieutenant. Look for somewhere to set your platoon down. Copy that. Talk to me about this Cerberus bomb. It's not Cerberus, Commander. It's... Turian. What do you mean, Turian? It was planted centuries ago, after the Krogan Rebellions. The bomb was a safeguard against another galactic war. Brutal, but it makes a certain kind of sense. Put the Krogan down hard if they tried anything. Makes sense. Couldn't trust the Krogan to play nice. But right now we focus on disarming that bomb. Yes, but Cerberus found it. Detonation means all-out war between my people and the Krogan. Right. Where is it? Those buildings ahead. Cerberus brought equipment to dig it up. The 9th Platoon will cover your flight, Commander. With all this activity, the Krogan have to know something's up. Then we can't fail, Commander. Copy that, Lieutenant. I'm at the control panel, Commander. Cerberus set up a firewall around the trigger mechanism to slow us down. I need to create a bypass. That'll take time. But like you said, no trigger, no explosion. Are you sure you can disarm the trigger? Yes, it's old tech. I know what to do. Buy me a few minutes, Commander. I put my team at risk to get you here, Lieutenant. You better deliver. I know what's at stake, Commander. And thank you for making sure I get this chance. Just make it right, soldier. Damn it! Commander! Focus on the bomb. We'll handle Cerberus. Commander! Firewall's down! I'm in! Spirits! Cerberus hacked the trigger mechanism! It's set to... Disarm it! No time! I have to separate the trigger from the bomb! Now! Cover me!
I've got radio chatter coming in from Krogan Forces planet side. Sounds like they started sweeping out the remaining Cerberus troops. Hate to be the guy who told the Krogan about that surprise package. Did you get out all right? Sounds like it got ugly down there. The Turians took a lot of casualties, Joker. The Primarch's son included. Understood, Commander. Joker out. He never hesitated. Whatever he was before, he'll be remembered for this. What will the Turians think about this, Garrus? Hard to say. Sacrifice and more is expected. He did us proud, but... We're a hard bunch to please. Living your life for the cause. Society first, platoon first. It's all just... expected. He did what he had to do when it counted. Yes. Yes, he did. Good work on Tachunka, Commander. Stopping that bomb prevented the war between the Turians and the Krogan. We can't afford that kind of division right now. Joker said the Krogan are recovering the bomb? They moved in. Won't allow Turians to send in recovery crews to help. Understandable. The situation is fragile at the moment. With Rex and the Primarch aboard the Normandy, you've got a situation brewing. We don't have a solid alliance between those two yet. Keep the peace, Commander. That's an order. Yes, sir. Pack it out. We couldn't risk another galactic war with the Krogan. The Genophage wasn't enough? You had to plant a bomb on my planet? The decision was made hundreds of years ago. So much has changed. Not enough to tell us about the bomb, coward. Hey! The Reapers are out there destroying the galaxy, and you want to fight about this. Primark, you had a bomb on Tachunka. And Rex, in the Turian's place, you would have done the same damn thing. Shepard! It's over. His own son died today making this right. Please, Commander. It's all right. Yes, fine. Shepard, you made your point. We have stronger enemies to face. We do. <sighs> I understand your reservations before, Commander. But I hope you now understand the secrecy. You kept this a secret and then put your son in charge? He couldn't handle it. Yes. You're right, Commander. It was a mistake not to trust you. I know that now. My son, he died with the respect of his men. I wanted to thank you for that. His sacrifice will be recorded in the histories of the Ninth Platoon. Something any father would be proud of. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs>